you know, it's really a shame to work all summer on your yard and have a nice looking yard and still end up with a few bare spots like this. Yeah, Danny, it is a little nasty, isn't it? Sure is. There's a couple things you can do. You can just kind of level this off and get some good soil in there and just uh, probably give it some fertilizer and wait for the grass that you have to fill in the hole. Ah, that'll take too long. What about doing the same thing and maybe putting some kind of grass seed in there. Will that sure. cover it up quicker? Sure, you want to just try and get grass seed that's similar to the lawn that you have. It's important to do it at the early part of the summer or the late part. Water it, just don't walk on it. Well, everybody, including myself, is a little impatient. So uh, That's for sure. What about that uh, instant lawn? <laughs> sod. Right, right. Well, sod is always a great option. Now, I mean, there are different types of sod available, and if you're going to work with sod, it's probably a good idea to take, carve out a little piece from your lawn and take it with you when you go to the shop and see what kind of sod you want to get to replace it. But once you've identified the type of sod you want to work with, it's really pretty simple. You're going to take this bare, raggedy spot and carve it out so that you've got a very regular shape, something that'll be easy to fill in. Now when you get your sod, it's about two inches thick, so you're probably going to take the soil out of this square to about two inches down, take that new piece of sod, lay it in there, water it in really well, and you've got a perfect lawn.